and welcome back to the channel on this video I'm riding the ride one up cafe cruiser and I thought on this video because I have been asked why I sold my aerial rider grizzly so I will tell you uh, why there's no real de facto rhyme or reason just a combination of things and uh, first of all I gotta say off the to buy this noisy leaf blower uh, I gotta say right off the bat it wasn't uh, anything to do with the bike uh, liking the bike or not liking the bike because uh, I don't have no issues with the aerial rider grizzly as far as whether I like the bike or not it's been a great bike in the two years that I've owned it. Uh, sure, there was a few issues along the way. Uh, the controllers was an issue, but that got resolved when Aerial Rider sent me new controllers. Ever since then, with the new controllers, I had no problems. And had to put a new set of tires on there, but you know what it doesn't matter what bike you're riding tires are going to be one of the things that you're going to have to put on eventually and they didn't last a long time the uh, stock tires on that bike they weren't the greatest but now it's got the v huntsman and they'll last a long time um so it's not anything to do with it wasn't anything to do at all with uh, the bike whether i liked it or not and it was more um, first of all um, you can only keep so many bikes you know uh, I don't have a big warehouse that I could store them all at and I can tell you if I did I'd be keeping every single uh, bike that I had um, but that's not the case I don't have a big warehouse to store them in um, so that was one of the factors another one was who I was selling it to uh, and who was getting the bike uh, and so it ended up being if you didn't see the video I'll put a link in the description if you want to watch the uh, video where a friend got surprised by his wife um, that would be uh, my friend Keith and his wife Sierra surprised him by buying the bike for him from myself. And I will leave a link in the description if you want to go and check out that video that we recently uh, posted on the channel. And the fact that Keith is getting the bike uh, is great because first of all, he's been riding the bike more than I have for the past several months. Um, so I haven't been riding the bike as much, although every time I got back on that, I absolutely <laughs> enjoyed every minute. Um, so him getting the bike was kind of cool for me because it meant that I would still see the bike and the bike would still get some time on the channel. which I really like that fact uh, because um, I know a lot of you out there um, like the Grizzly or have a Grizzly so the Grizzly is going to still be on the channel and but for the most part it'll be for sure it's under a different ownership now and it'll be uh, I will still probably ride it once in a while but it won't be I won't be riding it as my bike anymore, but I probably will, you know, once once in a while, we may trade off bikes and ride each other's bikes, which we, I'm sure we'll be doing. And uh, so that was another factor. And then I've got another bike coming in the next while. Um, as you probably know, the Lyric Graffiti X, and 
I think once I get the Lyric Graffiti X, I think I'm going to be on that bike a lot. That bike has just about everything that I uh, want in a bike. So uh, that's why I, I got the bike. I know Lyric well, um, having purchased their Lyric Graffiti 2022 model. And you know, as much as I like that bike, the upgrades that they've done on the new Graffiti X as compared to the Graffiti 2022 model, um, you know, they're just hard to pass that one up. And so uh, knowing, like I say, how well the Graffiti 22, 2022 was, or is, I, I still have it, um, then by adding a little more power, a little more speed, a little more, uh, definitely more um, suspension, nice large battery, uh, nice uh, tires, uh, on-road, off-road tires, you know, all that. It looks great. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. So a combination of all those things, I thought, yeah, you know what? And the other thing was, um, selling it now is probably good for Keith because now he gets to ride it for the summer here because, you know, the weather's only, like everywhere else, I guess, most places anyway, we only have the best weather only lasts for a certain amount of months, you know, and then, then we're into the crappy weather season, so. And uh, it's nice to be able to ride it for the summer enjoy it and um, so that's what we did and so I'm anticipating uh, getting the uh, the graffiti X is supposed to come in August so uh, I'm ready and uh, I'm not ruling out other bikes uh, as well so but we'll just leave it at that as for uh, right now that's that's where we're at and that's why we sold the Grizzly and if it sounds like a kind of a lame answer well that's all I got for you so that that's it basically in a nutshell like I say if I could keep if I could keep every uh, single bike that I have and every future bike you know uh, I certainly would do it because it's hard to uh, to let the bikes go because if you're a bike enthusiast like myself I mean I get crazy when I see anybody else with an electric bike I think it's awesome and um, so yeah but we'll see where the future where everything goes here but as for right now that's where we're at and uh, who knows where we're going onward and upward I guess we go with the channel so anyway that's my story in a nutshell um, but like I say you won't be um, the channel won't be going along here without seeing uh, quite a bit actually of the uh, of the Grizzly so uh, you're probably gonna actually see it more than uh, than you have been because I haven't been riding it as much and uh, so with Keith, he'll be riding it probably a lot uh, when I do ride with him. So you'll see it quite a bit. So that's my uh, quick story here of uh, why I sold my Aerial Rider Grizzly. So thank you for joining me on this video. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel and uh, help support us and uh, help us grow just hit that subscribe button thank you very much for doing that and if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified and also if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video go ahead and leave that in the comments below 
Once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road.